you are not even taking into consideration. Yeah, so may I change come. your mind? We're, we're going to that. I promise we're, you. We're going to. That. I promise you. We're going to go to that. We're going to that. Actually, I'll let Hashim answer you on this claim because it won't make a difference if I answer someone else, will it? Yeah, okay. For you, if you get an answer, you get an answer. Yeah. Yeah. Truth is truth, right? Truth okay, is truth, and the Bible is truth. For what me. is the biggest? I want to ask the audience one question. Yeah. Muslims, Christians, atheists, anyone alike. What is the biggest change of of status in this world? Is it a job status? Is it an age status? Is it what is it? I think it is death. Would anyone here disagree with me? The biggest change that we go through in this world is life to death. Mm -hmm. Now in Malachi, yeah, yeah, in Malachi. All right. So now let's talk about Jesus. Jesus went through life, death, death resurrection, resurrection, life again, etc. Yeah. Fine. And now he's in heaven. Yeah. Malachi three six says. I am the Lord and I do not change. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. So is that just like forgetting the fact that Jesus did change? He changed his state, did he not? He went through life, death, life again. But not his essence. I did not change. Not his essence. No, his essence. That, right. right. So guys, in other words, in, in, guys, in essentiality, right, he never changed. But he did I, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, said what God and has tweeted. And, and he did rise. But I he I didn't change down, in his essence. I want to put a point down. I want to put a point down for everyone who comes here to say that the Trinita Trinitarian belief is a true belief. When you guys are using the word essence, Please back it up with evidence, but what, what, because your word essence amen. is just what, something what, that what, you use as a weak means to explain your like yours. Moment. You don't understand what? that Jesus I'm was God in the flesh. We challenge you to prove yeah. to right. us. All right, let's no, listen. Listen. Sorry, we'll explain to brains like yours which don't that's understand. Brains like mine. Uh, I would yes, like brains just like to, yours which cannot I, I would comprehend like just the word of God. You don't understand. The word of God is above you. It's beyond you. You cannot comprehend it. Moment. You picked up a verse. I mean, let me just say this. Do you read Hebrew? How do you have your belief no, if you no, don't read Hebrew yourself? You picked up a verse in Malachi. I'm okay. We just need huh? it from the you picked up a verse in Malachi. Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah. I would like just to ask you, what do you know about Malachi? Not much. Okay. But what I do know okay. is enough to know that I can let me, refute let me, your, yeah. let me, your claim I like, I'm, try, I'm trying to answer what to your, your statement about me. I'm just asking you, what do you know about Malachi? Okay, you said you don't know. I said I don't know much, but I know okay. enough to know. No, I, I'm just, I'm I know enough to know. Ma 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 yes, if you're going to ask me a question, allow me to answer from capital letter to full stop. Okay. I started by saying okay. I don't know much about it, but no, no, no. Let's, let's start from the Wait, beginning. You what do you know about? So you can see. Text, we we right? start from the beginning. Right? What do you know that about Malachi? Okay. Enough to know. Enough to know that this claim stands to refute your claim that Jesus okay. is God. My second question is: When Malachi, as a prophet and as a book, was written, what difference does it make? At least for, the for, for me, it makes a difference, and now I'll tell you why. Please do. Okay. Refers to a composite. What Malachi is doing? Malachi is one of the prophets. Malachi is a prophet related with the with the exile. Malachi is a prophet related with the exile of Israel after Babylonian and Assyrian before right. deportation. Right. So Malachi, when he talks about God, does not change. He's talking about the law of God. That's the law of God. This is what, this is my question. You are, you, you are reading a verse of Malachi without knowing the context. It's not a question. It's not a statement about the essence of God. It's a statement is about the it's law. not about the essence of God. No, he just said about... it's not about the essence. But okay, man. You're Even talking with me, point, I'm happy. No problem. You know on your point, Stefano. But you are using that verse to talk up. To, you are using the, Lord, the verse Lord, to raise up questions no like problem. him. To talk right. about the answer let's, to God. Let's use I'm it telling you, that verse okay, doesn't fine, have fine, to do with the answer let's of God. It has to do with the law. You say the law of God. With what he says. Can you tell me what the Ten Commandments says about God? Distinctive ones. What is the Ten Commandments? Do you know them all? Yeah. Yeah. Does the Ten Commandments say that God is one? The Ten Commandments says that, that God, God is one. The Ten Commandments says that God is the one that we have to worship. Which commandment is that? The first. Is it the first? Yeah. Okay. So the first of the Ten Commandments says that God is one. Yeah. But you stand here to say that God is. I'm saying that is God what? is what? I'm telling you. And by the way, the Ten Commandments. Let me, let me, sorry. Let me ask you. you, said you let me just finish my question. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. These commandments. Many people 
Why? Sorry, these commandments Why? are these law, laws from God? Yes, these are laws from God. Yes, and you said and they that tell, God, for example, to keep the Sabbath. You, said, you are keeping on, the Friday, hold on, hold on, which is something new. And you said, and you said, God said, God said, He doesn't change His laws in accordance yeah. to your yeah. interpretation yeah. of Malachi yeah. Yeah. three six. That yeah. so God doesn't change His laws. Yeah. But in the Ten Commandments, yeah. God says yeah. that God is one. Yes. But now you're saying so. Now there's a contradiction again. Do you Look, see the problem you have? What, what, I'm, what I'm saying is the Hebrew word. If you read the Bible in the Old Testament, you will see that God never presented Himself as one. But you've never in Genesis chapter one says that Elohim created men and women and says, "Let us make men to our own image." So can you answer me? That is Genesis one twenty six and twenty seven. Can you explain the first ten commandments? Can you explain the first yes. commandments? What I'm saying is that probably I don't know what I don't know how much you know of Christianity and what Trinitarian belief is. I believe. Stop saying that to try and deviate. I'm asking you the first commandment. God is one. God is God is one. Look. God is God one. So do you believe when I'm talking about God is one, I'm not, say, okay, I'm not saying that God is one numerically Stefano, one. I'm, I'm saying that God is Stefano. God, no, Jesus, no, the, the Father, you and the Holy Spirit are three divine yeah. beings. Yeah. Just, to, you know, one. Just to finish off, one plus one plus one, what's the answer to it? I'm saying, when you're talking about God, okay. Are you going to be here? No, I have to go. You have to go? But what's one plus one plus one? It's combined That's with a verb you're in singular. You are there is a able mystery. to talk. Yeah, but we spoke about the Ten Commandments. We spoke Malachi. We spoke Genesis. We spoke Matthew. We spoke to talk about God in mathematics. And are you coming up 600 years later with an inspiration which is not inspired? Please come back. And what about Mahoma? He comes and says something different from the Bible. I don't believe it, man. You know what I want you to do? If you can do it, take the time to open up the Quran. Today, I stood here to speak to you about the Bible. The Bible. Genesis. The disciples. Yeah. By the way, they never saw. None of them saw about Christianity None of them saw. without knowing anything about Christianity. I know enough to use the Bible. I know enough properly. I know enough to debunk your religion. To debunk your faith, I know enough. What I will say is debunk me at all. You just presented a bunch of verses out of context without any proof. The first of and the Ten Commandments is... When I told you, what's the first of the Ten Commandments? Is God is one. God is one. How many gods do you have? No, no, no. I have one God. It means that God. And, and just to, just to commentate... It, but God is God. Right, no problem. And just for the Quran as well, for what the Quran says about this. In the Quran it says, Say not three, or it is better for you. Yeah, but I know what the Quran says. I just don't believe it. We don't, and you don't understand. You don't understand. I don't understand what God is. Come back. You don't understand God. You don't understand what the Bible says about God. In chapter 4, verse 82 in the Quran, Quran, yes. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala challenges, challenges anyone to find contradictions yeah. in the text. I would so like anyone Stefano that can say that inspiration of the Quran coming 600 years later is more than the Bible. What? I want a proof of that. I want a proof. What's that got to do with Come with a proof. Come, What's that got to do with come the next time with a proof. Not someone that says, I'm a mama. I got a vision. Someone gave me something and that's better than the Bible. Come with some proof of that. Okay. Hinduism is older than some proof. Come with some proof. In our, in our shahada, Okay, I want to explain something to you and for the camera, inshallah. Yeah? In our shahada, our testimony of faith, we have two things. La ilaha illallah, Muhammad Rasulullah. There is no deity worthy of worship but Allah. And Muhammad is his prophet and messenger or servant or slave and messenger. What did Allah, what did Muhammad do for Muhammad? What did he do for Muhammad? Wait, 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 wait. What did he do for Muhammad? Wait, wait, wait. What did he do for Muhammad? So, Has he died for us? Wait, wait. Muhammad. So, what, I'm, for what, what I want you to understand. How can we, how can we for, be forgiven of sin? I know. Allow me to finish. Yes, but you have to answer important questions, not just to do something on a video so that people can see you, that you are presenting something. It's like, like, you know, it's like a video, you know, in which you are presenting a fight, a fight, a fight, it's all about, it's all about the camera, a fight and showing it is 100% all about the camera to show you viewers at home what's going on here. So of course if you are going to put this on YouTube, I would personally say, that's kind of a joke. How can you do that? How can you do that? My channel is not monetized. Try to answer My channel is not monetized. I'm not going to pay about the inspiration of the Quran. Try to answer about forgiveness of Okay. How, try to answer about Mahoma being greater than Jesus. No? No. You, wanna, you wanna do something for the video? Then keep on. You're for the video as well. You've been contributing. Can we? Can I speak? Yeah. Our shahada as Muslims is this: there's no deity worthy of worship but Allah, and Muhammad is his messenger. Now that first part of the shahada, that we say that Jesus is the Son of God, and it's higher than Mahoma. Are you gonna let me talk? 
Yeah. But I know what you are saying. Don't say but. No. Yes, you said yes. Want to so, let me okay. so, when you take that first part of the shahada, there is no deity worthy of worship. But, okay. So, when I speak to you, when I speak to you, that's the point I'm trying to make. When we speak to you, first, if I speak to, for example, an atheist, I'll say an atheist is closer to Islam and Allah knows best, but in theory, an atheist is closer to Islam than he is to uh, than a Christian is. Why? Because you, as a Christian, if I want to, we come here to speak about Islam, just as you came here to speak about Christianity and whatever else. When I come here, I come here to call people to what I believe is truth, and you do the same. Yes. Now, in order for me to try and help you come to what I believe is truth, I have to make you see that what you believe in first is false. And that's why. Right. that you use the Bible wrongly. Yeah, but if he then shows you that what you believe in is false. Of course, it's, it's, a, it's the same theory. Of course, yeah. it's the same theory. Yeah, but that's you why I challenged him. False in his no, 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 I challenged him already. I said, prove to me. And by the way, you're someone that stands I, I to, to open up the biblical scriptures anyway to have false so, well, yeah, but you know, I can open up the Quran and show you. That would be fantastic. Let's do it later. Let's do I need to pray. But yeah. what I will say is this. I stood here today to tell you that our religion is false. I know that you said so. Now I challenge you to open up our Quran. Okay? The gentleman I challenge you to show me the inspiration. It's just Christianity that you're following. Yeah. The Bible, the Torah. Do you agree with that? It's not false itself. Right? But, but at least you have more of a foundation than a Muslim. All right. What I was working with, he say from from the beginning. If you have to close the video, just close it. I don't need to close it. No, he has to go pray. He has to pray before he comes to the He needs, he needs guidance before he comes to the right. uh, What I will say, uh, I actually read it out earlier and I'll just read it again. Yeah? And this is from Surah al kahf the Surah of the Cave. It's the 18th Surah in the Quran. And this is what we believe Allah Almighty says. I know, I know that you believe that. I, I, I know. I, I, I can say that. I know what you believe. Yeah, but belief is different from knowing, isn't it? Belief is simple for things that you do not know. So, because I believe in aliens. Yeah, What's belief me? All the praises and thanks be to Allah who has sent down to his slave the book and has not placed there in any crookedness. He hasn't sent anything there. The There's no proof. In the book of Revelation. I know, but I don't know, but I don't know, know, but I don't know where you're finding fault. No, but I'm no, no, reading no. it because he's saying Allah sent down something. There's no proof in it. In the book of Revelation, it's written that all honor and glory goes to Jesus. Gary, 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 you stopped me before I'd even commented. No, but the first thing you said, Allah sent down. Where are you finding fault in what I'm saying? Because there's no proof that Allah said that anything. Where are you? Coming? All right, that's the fault then. Okay, fine. In my book, my, my book, the Quran says that everything's truth in the Quran. No, in but it book, doesn't start. What do you mean no? It, no, it doesn't what start. What do you mean no? no? You're going to find, you're going to open this up to us. And you're going to show us. You're going to show us. Hold on. Right. You're going to show us, hopefully, Gary, yes. where in the Quran, yeah, there's errors. I'll hold it. Listen to what I'm saying. Please. Don't yes. dictate. No, no, I'll have to dictate. This don't is dictate. Allah, Allah, yeah. I know it's says in the Quran, yeah, that this book doesn't have any crooked I, I want you, and I, I want you, anything. what I challenge you to Man do Man says that. All right, Gary, please, allow me to start. Right. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, I have an appointment. I need to right. help you out. Come back, yeah? Come back. You're leaving him alone now, yeah? Is that right? No, I don't leave him alone, but anyway, I think that's kind of an improductive. Come back, come back. So you're going to pray now, right? 